Look at this piece of shit. It's called an iPod Touch. And I've had this thing for a year now, and I hate it. And the update basically turned the iPod into rip-off, wannabe, knock-off, Android. Example 1. Slide down notification bar. Uh, Android idea. Another thing is that Apple and all of their apps, they claim that none of their apps crash and anything. Yeah, they're really perfect and don't crash at all. Yeah, pretty much. They pretty much don't crash at all. They're right. Considering this picture, they're right. And another thing, camera opens up quick. But then if you have it set to video, and you close it on video, and then you reopen it, isn't that quick and convenient? Usually it takes a really long time for it to open, and the quality of the camera is horrible. See that? Garbage. It actually makes everything look blue. So, another thing that I should bring attention to, see this YouTube app right here, right there? Yeah, if you're watching videos on that and you use the top thing to scroll back and forth through the video, it's actually going to freeze up and then you're going to have to reload the whole video all over again. Doesn't that sound great? Yeah. Um, what else does it have? Um, oh yeah, let me, hold on, I need to go get something for a nice apple for this one. Um, where's the box? See this thing? It's the iPod box. Yeah. iPod touch. Guess what? The box says 32 gigs, but you want to know something? This iPod here says 28.5. Isn't that great? You pay 230 for 32 gigs, and then you go on the iPod to find out you have 28.5. Isn't that great? I think so, and I barely use stuff. Look. I only have a little bit of stuff. And I only have 1.5 gigs available. So, let me tell you a little bit about the money. $300 went into this iPod. About. Um, I paid 230 for the iPod and two year warranty. And Apple is so fucking shitty that they only covered me for one when I bought two years. And they only covered me for one. They expired my warranty on the 17th, which is about four or five days ago, is it? I don't know. And I spent another $30 on this. This case is so terrible. Look at how terrible it is. Shake, shake, shake. And it comes off. And this thing's broken too. See that? It's broken and scratched up. And look how much care it's taken off of my iPod. Isn't that great care right there? I think it is. Yeah, don't you think that's good here? That's a lot of scratches. So, if this was a scratch proof, if this was scratch proof, then I'd say it's done a good job because it's scratched. Um, more things about this thing. 
I won't. Okay, there we go. Going to general. They have software updates now. I think I've seen this with Android as well. Way before this had software updates. You only had to connect it to the computer in order to get that. Usage. Just another way to tell you how much memory you have. Um, Wi-Fi sync. Um, yeah, Wi-Fi sync. It's not even synced into my iTunes anymore because I had to reset it. This thing has Twitter. Isn't that a surprise? I don't even fucking use Twitter because I think Twitter is stupid. While my phone has Facebook and all that other crap. It has everything. Anything integration. My phone only costed me a hundred and forty two dollars. Obviously half of how much this iPod cost. A hundred and forty two for the phone, eight dollars for lifetime insurance. And yeah, that's for that. And then I spent seven dollars on this great plastic case right here for my phone which is not on right now and my SD card which came with the phone and my little keychain mascot right here whatever and then I spent another ten dollars on a car charger which I can't show you because it's in my car um yeah another thing is that no matter this thing has location services. If you have it on or off, no matter what, Apple can track your location. See that purple little thing right there? Apple is tracking this iPod, just like they do with all their Apple products. So basically, as we speak right now, I'm, as I'm making this video, Apple is stalking me. Yeah. They're tracking my location, trying to stalk me. They might even be outside my house listening as I make this video right now. Who knows? So, um, and one more thing. And if you have your phone in lock and you double tap, anyone can get into your photos. And then your friends can mess around and take pictures of really stupid things like that and take videos as well and guess what it can be seen right here see that see that but then if you delete it you can't see anything else because your iPod is locked so they can basically take as much pictures and videos as they want unless you come in, until you come into the room so basically this thing is three dollars, three hundred dollars gone to waste. I wish it was three dollars. So you want to know what I say to this? I say, I want to say one more thing about this iPod. Oops, I didn't even do it right. Hold on. Uh, iPod. What I think about Apple. I still didn't do it right. <laughs> Proper way for iPod to go like that. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, fuck Apple. Thank you.